I'd say the most telling thing that we've learned in the last probably eight to 10 years is that the shark populations are going up. At first, I didn't believe it. We're, we're telling the public shark populations are in trouble. They're being overfished in many parts of the world. But when I started looking more into the system, I began to realize, well, maybe this is real. Maybe the data that we're seeing is real. What would explain that? When you start looking, I mean, white sharks, for example, were, were fished commercially. Um, and if a white shark was caught prior to 1994, they were sold in fish markets. People would eat them, especially the babies, because they were the ones that people interacted with the most. But in 1994, the state of California passed legislation to protect white sharks because we recognized how easy it was to overfish them. And since then, we've seen numbers kind of steadily go up. And of course, that's being recognized by the public because they're seeing more of those babies too. So then I started asking, well, what do white sharks eat? Well, adult white sharks like to eat marine mammals. And marine mammal populations were overhunted almost 100 years ago, but have been protected since the 70s. And since then, their populations have been steadily growing. In fact, seal and sea lion populations have really kind of exploded. And of course, that is a really important food for the adult white shark. So the recovery of marine mammals has allowed white shark population to come back even stronger. How can they be growing that fast when we're telling the public it, our oceans overfished and it's so polluted that all the fish are gone? So these are things that I think are showing that we're doing something right for the ocean. We have been doing this since the 70s. It's just taken decades for us to see these effects. And we now have cleaner water, we have better fisheries, and our shark populations are recovering, our marine mammal populations are recovered. In many ways, we have a healthier ocean now than we did 40 years ago.